We're here with John Settle, the head coach over at Sunnyvale here on PSquaredSports.com. I'm Jeff Power, part of the Padilla Poll. Thank you, Coach, for being with us, first of all. Thanks for having me. You guys are coming off a baseball state championship, and I know you've got some players on that baseball team that are going to play football. Thoughts about what that meant for the community and how that could maybe translate into keeping that winning attitude going in football? Well, you know, one of the things we talk about in our, in our program is, is learning how to win, learning how to finish. And our baseball team really has been close for several years. You know, they lost in the regional finals, you know, to Brock, to a good Brock team. And, you know, they were just able to, to make that play. And so that's one of the things we talk to our kids about is, you know, we, we, you know, going back to last football season, we lost three games by seven points total. And so hopefully that's just part of the maturation process of a new program and a new school. So hopefully we learn how to finish. And your team did finish seven and three last year, but those three losses were in district. Tell me about six, three, a division one pretty tough district last year's district. Yeah, uh, I mean, you know, we had two years ago when we got in that district uh, again, you know, a new school and we got dropped in there with schools are coming down out of three a and commerce and Van Alstein and, a, and an awfully good Pottsboro program. And so every Friday night was just a just a dogfight, you know, and so we, we've grown up a whole bunch in two years, but no cakewalk this year. I see no. Scurry Rosser and uh, of course, Cotto, Mills, and Commerce. Right. I mean, these are teams that are you know, Live Oak, Red Oak. These are teams that people have heard of. They know about their programs. How do you prepare yourself for the district schedule? Do you have a tough non-district schedule? Do. We do. Um, our non-district schedule is, 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 is pretty tough. We, we open up with a really good godly program. Um, we go on the road to Eustis. We go on the road uh, to Redwater. Uh, so we play in between that. We play two uh, 4A programs in Nevada Community and, and Venus. So. You know, the, the goal is, um, you know, we want to be better at, at, at the end of those games uh, and be ready for a district play. Hunter Allen, one of your leaders on defense. Just tell me about your defense and the importance of having those guys over there kind of being leaders and being captains and, you know, taking the young guys arm around their, their neck and just letting them know what they need to do to be successful at the high school level. Right. Hunter's an awfully good player. Um, you know, another uh, guy over there, we have a, a linebacker named Connor Mears. Connor's going to be a four-year starter for us. So. To your point, um, you know, those guys have to be good players. You know, I've always said, uh, you know, you're only as good as your seniors. And, you know, that's generally true. Right. Uh, final thoughts as you guys get prepared for the season. How excited are you? This is year three for you, right? This will be year four for year me. Year four actually, now, okay. Yes. So how excited are you? You're, you're kind of, you feel like you've kind of got your program where you want it. you got your players and coaching staff in place. I, I think so. Um, you know, generally, the general school rule of thumb is that, you know, it takes you about three years. Um, I felt like last year we, we played awfully well. I mean, we played awfully well. Our, our entire athletic program had a great year. So, you know, we, we, I think we're ready to take that next step and, and, and uh, you know, be an awfully good program going forward. Very good. John Settle, thank, thank you, you so much. Sunnyvale High School, PSquaredSports.com. Also, uh, catch us out here on the Padilla Poll. I'm Jeff Power. Okay. Thank you.